YouTube's going on, it's John John and I'm back with another video wearing the same shirt as last video. That's because I just finished the other one and I just came back and said, hey, why not pump out this next one? The fall season is here. The weather feels beautiful outside in Georgia. Atlanta, Georgia is where I live. The weather feels great. Um, so I'm giving you guys an honest opinion of these boot boot choice that I have that I've been wearing. You've probably seen, if you follow me on IG, another IG plug, John John Vlogs, follow me on IG. But if you do follow me there, you've seen that I have these boots from Urban Outfitters. And this is the one year, I've actually one year ago today, I purchased these boots. Um, so I figured I would make this video because um, this is the one year um, update, I guess, on these boots. So yeah, these boots were purchased at Urban Outfitters. I'll probably have some type of overlay going right now. These boots were purchased at Urban Outfitters a year ago today. Um, these were highly recommended by a lot of people uh, for a cheap alternative to a Chelsea boot. Um, and honestly, I have enjoyed these boots. I've enjoyed wearing them. I've worn them like a lot, a lot. And you, as you can see from the overlay, they've held up quite nice. I would have think about to, ugh. I would have thought by now that the sole would have probably like depleted and like been really, really worn down. But as much for as much as I've worn these, the sole still looks like very good. It's, I'm not saying it's any type of luxury like boot or anything like this way just feels very very good or anything Because I mean it's not bad, but it's not the best like you can definitely tell that it's not cheaply made But it's not any type of luxury But if you only want to spend I believe sometimes these are on sale too If you only want to spend $78, $90, $100 for a boot instead of going to the like common projects route or you know, St. Laurent, all that type of stuff, boot for upwards of four or five hundred dollars. This boot right here is definitely a great option. I'm gonna be picking up another pair of these very, very soon. Um, but I definitely recommend this boot. Um, I'll probably cut to this is from some brand called Hawkins McGill. Never heard of Hawkins McGill, but if you are out there, sir, congratulations on these because these are awesome. There's the pink pair that I really want to get. I don't know why, but I'm really into the color pink for fall. Um, that's more of a spring color, but I think pink works really well in the fall for some reason. Like all black with some pink. But yeah, we're going to go ahead and cut to an on feet portion of this boot. Um, let me know what you guys think of Urban Outfitters and all these. There's other brands that do like a, um, a, uh, Chelsea boot for like a cheaper, cheaper price point. Let me know of any other brands that you know of, um, that do a boot like this for under a hundred dollars, a little bit over something like that. And maybe I'll check it out. This is John John and I'm signing out. I'm going to catch you guys on the next video. If you're not already subscribed, subscribe down below. I cannot say it enough. If you're not subscribed, you're missing out. I'm just going to tell you right now, you're missing out. If you are not subscribed, you are genuinely missing something. So it's down below. Go ahead and subscribe. And um, that's going to be it. Stay tuned for some more videos. I'm out.